Everybody's probably trying to figure out why we're standing outside. This week, I'm gonna do things a lot different than what I normally do. There are new rules at this competition. You guys are participating in the Captain Solo, and you guys are also participating in Stand Battle. But this is the twist. The person that is gonna be doing the Captain Solo is the same person that's gonna have to lead Stand Battle. I'm not gonna even use my clipboard. I'm gonna have a head-to-head face-off to make a decision as to who's gonna do the solo. Whoever does the solo is gonna do stands. Time for us to start grooming the new captain to take over. Kayla has served seven years with this team. It's time for her to groom the next person to move on. So that leads Cameron and Tamia. Tamia is a great dancer. You know, the battle is kind of what she does. The battle is who she is. Tamia always knows how to handle herself. Her attitude when she dances it draws you in. Her smile is infectious. It makes people want to watch her. I don't think I've ever seen Tamia mad. Probably ever. All y'all looking real crazy right now. Y'all like what? Cameron is a variety of everything. She's dependable, she's one of my heavy hitters, and she's one of my go-to girls. In the last year and a half, Cameron has become way more vocal. She's paving the way for herself to take over Kayla's spot. Kayla's not gonna be the captain for the week, and I'll be looking for Cameron or Tamia to get up there and kill it. I need a person that's more diverse to do the solo, but on the flip side, in stands, I need somebody that's more aggressive and has that hip hop and that attitude and personality. The solo is all Cameron. The stands, it's all Tamia. What the hell am I supposed to do? Like I can only have one or the other. I can't have both. You say you want to be captain, right? You say you want her spot, right? You say you want her spot. Prove it. So let's have a good old fashioned face off. Who going first? Tamia, okay. I love the choreography that she made up for her solo, but to me, a solo just seems like it's unfinished. And as a coach, I know it's my job to fix it, and I don't have a problem doing that. But I really wanted to me to step outside the box and try something different. Like Cameron's solo really surprised me. Cameron's solo has a lot of hip hop in it. Cameron hates hip hop. And I think that Cameron was going for that shock value for me. Cameron may be the quiet one, but I've seen her on tour. I watched her come back at Kayla. I knew what was about to happen. <laughs> picking for the solo this week, we have to make a decision today and I'm going with Cameron. Ultimately, I ended up picking Cameron because I feel like I could pump Cameron up. I could really, really push her to cross the finish line when it comes to stands. And with stands, this is gonna be the ultimate test. The potential for either one of y'all to be captain. It's there. It's gonna be, it's definitely there. To me, she has a great, stage presence. Cameron is very talented. It's like the scales. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're going back and forth.